Ah, uh, YouTube, it's yours truly back with another lineup update. And as you can see, we got a 97 overall team, 97 offensively, 97 defensively. Perfectly balanced, like all things should be. I got the Beyonce Crazy in Love instrumental, because I'm crazy in love with this team. We're going to start off with Super Bowl MVP Patrick Mahomes, boy. You know my homeboy. If you haven't seen the highlight reel of this guy, man, please go check it out. Did a highlight reel of this man. He can do it all. The only problem I really got with him is Roman Deadeye. I promise you I let go of R2, and I still get a few inaccurate passes. So I'm thinking about switching back over to Dashing Deadeye. But the reason I'm still using Roman, I'm going to give it one more week to get used to. Because it's a combination of no-look Deadeye. Right, so I can throw uh, cross body passes, right? So I could be running to the right throw all the way to the left side of the field. Plus Roman Dead Eye, right? Stand outside the pocket. Plus Dashing Dead Eye on the run, right? And so, like, just got to let go of R2 just before you throw it. Maybe I'm, I don't know. I'm going to give it one more week. And it's crazy he has 99 throw on the run, but that doesn't matter. It's all about abilities on this game. So even if I uh, do accidentally keep holding R2, there's a 50-50 chance he might complete it or might uh, get an inaccurate. Pretty whack. ED, the Viagra update fixed zero problems. It did not work. <laughs> it did not work whatsoever. I thought about switching back to Marcus Allen, but no. ED is still a problem. We're going to need some new pills. <laughs> wow, that card is just that great. Speaking of great cards, got some wide receivers here. Leveled up uh, Tory Holt. Grinded those level masters. Like that same Mutt Hero Booth Breaker Techno Color uh, commentary. Uh, did that over and over and over. Uh, we also grinded, uh, but we got top 100 in Weekend League. We we're 22 and 1. Had two disconnects, so we still finished top 50 with 22 and 3. And we used our trophies on John Madden rushing. We got Run Block. Uh, so now we got John Madden passing and rushing match. I'm surprised none of our players went up in overall. Cause now they get go deep, zone run maxed out. Then they got uh, both John Madden and then Sprinter and, or Brawler. Like they're really G'd up. And only got getting plus ones from all that. But look at this Calvin Johnson. 99 speed, 99 jump, 98 deep right running, 99 spec catchy, six foot five, absolute stud. Got great run block too. Look at Tory Holt. I grinded during the level uh, that solo. Really good, too. I mean, Moss might be the best one because I got abilities on him. So, whenever I bring out Moss, I normally run... A lot of people don't know how to use Moss 100. You never use it first place. You use it on third and forever when you need it. On fourth down in the third or fourth quarter, you wait on it, right? You don't just use it right away. I'm telling you guys. If you're using it right away, you're not using Moss, right? Uh... Show you guys the ability. I got street specialists on them just in case I don't have enough time to get 50 yards down the field. All right, let's say they sent eight people, right? Even if they got Moss one on one, I can throw it to them quick. It's going to be like 30, 40 yards, right? Got my hell on street, right? But I might switch that over to Post Flag Elite. Post Flag Elite was really good, especially paired up with Slot, Appren uh, Slot Apprentice. Here we got the O line, Walter Jones. I normally don't like upgrading my O line. But he wasn't even that expensive. I got, I pulled his 93 overall card. And that card was like the second highest piece for him. So then I had to go get like four other pieces. The 95 was pretty expensive. But other than that, I mean, probably like 200K. Say like 125K pulling that card. Made him. And then uh, got him in right here. So we still got our 97 power-up pass. We can use on whatever card we want. This instrumental is about to go off. Let me go find another one. Back with a 147 Cowboy MVP instrumental. Kind of you guys envy the team. Just look at it. J just go ahead and look at it. Hard work, dedication, all of it. But Walter Jones, man, I had to upgrade off of Joe Thomas. Because goodness gracious. Wow, that dude was horrible. But uh, I'm going to show you guys some stats here on Walter Jones eventually. This isn't live, by the way. I tried to uh, do it live. And for some reason, the audio didn't record. I, I don't know why, so I'm, I'm just going to go ahead and play the instrumentals now and uh, voice over it. Glad I caught that. Uh, but Okay, what am I doing? I don't even know what I was doing here. I might went to go use the restroom and just came back. I don't know what I was doing. I was on Walter Jones for way too long. I like him, but he ain't that good. Oh, my. 
But one of our newest additions, you compare him to Joe Thomas, it's not even close, man. Look at all those 99s in the middle. Those are the only ones that matter. Uh, run block, pass block power, pass block finesse. So the two on the bottom don't matter in pass block. Like in the upper middle doesn't matter. But you see the strength is good too. He's faster than Joe Thomas by far. I should flip to the back and show you guys that. But it, it don't matter. I don't know what I was doing here. Maybe I was drunk. There you go. It just took me some time. But, uh... No money spent, 97 overall, just straight grinding with 2.5 mil in reserves. And we still got more, because we got 92 Christian Okoye report from the uh, pack opening that you guys saw. And we got a 94 player from making top 50 in Weekend League to pull, running for limited times to be in packs. So going to try to pull one of those from it. So, we're looking real nice. I want to show you guys this with Kevin Maway. I didn't notice this before. First, look at Maway, this power-up pitcher, and then look at his full card. It's the same as that pitcher. That's why I chose the Legend card art. I really like how they added this, how you can change the art, but that's crazy lazy by EA. Look at your boy coming through with the bars. Crazy lazy. Velcro unstrapped with the mouthpiece and the face mask. Same thing down there. Velcro un unstrapped, mouthpiece with the face mask. Same thing. They just added snow on that one. I wouldn't have noticed that until they added this. I was like, wow. Very disappointing EA there. I, I get recycling from year to year. Like, Night Train Lane literally has the same pitchers every year. They, they must only have three pitchers in Night Train Lane. No exaggeration. But, come on now. Kevin will weigh. He's a more modern-day player. Uh, we got Zach Martin. Team of the Year highlights. Go check those out you like. We got uh, Lane Johnson here. Really good card. But I went with his Blitz card. He got the Super Bowl Uh car and yeah we do have them up that high but eh, I just like that splash of the fusion lights or whatever that is on the blitz cars man they look real cool to me flashing lights like Kanye you feel me uh, you got George Kittle too team of the year highlights I like to say thank you to everybody that's seen any of my videos but that Eric Dickerson video really did well so that's cool it's always great to uh, get videos that go viral for yourself, right? When I consider viral, I ain't talking about the number of views, but like the amount. So like 10 times your uh, subscriber account is really great. Uh, here, we got Khalil Mack. And we upgrade him with the Series Redux, 450K uh, it costs. But he went up plus 5 speed. So when he's a 93 overall, he had 83 speed. Now he got 88. And you remember, we got uh, Brawler. So, he really got 91 with John Madden coaching and all that. You can't run from him. You can't run towards him. Like, Blot Shed is crazy. Really great card, man. Escape artist will not save you. You need Jesus. I'm trying to tell you. Compare him to uh, LT. And they're really, they're clones now. They're clones. If I compare it to from LT's perspective, it'd be about even, too. Really great cards, man. This instrumental is about to end, so I'm going to come back with another one. Back with the Little Wayne Hustler music instrumental. One of my favorite instrumentals as you showcase one of the, my favorite side of the ball. I love playing defense, man. Where should I start? Uh, we're going to start with Sean Taylor. Uh, great card. Got him on Christmas. Jamal Adams. Pat Tillman. I got backups that could start on your team. Like, honestly, they could start on your team, man. We got Jamal Adams, but he's going to get replaced by Taylor Mays. I think I hinted at it in the Team of the Year video, but I'm not sure if I said the name, but Taylor Mays will be replaced on that, Pat Tillman. I need to get Taylor Mays' power up. I'm not paying 60K for a power Well, no, 90K he's at right now. I'm not paying 60K either, so when I come back from out of town, hopefully he's around 20K. I'll cop him then, power him up. Uh, but Taylor Mays, man, great card. He's a... Uh, Two inches taller, way better jumping, more block shed. Can't cover as well as Jamal Adams, but that's all right. He can do other things. We got Brian Erlacher, man. Six foot four, big boy. Compare him to Ryan Shazier, way better. It's not even comparable, really. Uh, the zone coverage that Erlacher has is better. The block shed is, oh my goodness. Like, Ryan Shazier would get blocked. And then, like, completely taken out of the play. So then the running back's got lanes to run. Now with Erlacher there, he he's still finna get blocked. He's not avoiding the block, but he might be able to shed. Or he's finna get 
uh, close enough in the backfield where the running back got to run a different way. And then Pat Willis normally makes the tackle. So Erlacher doesn't have that many highlights. He only got sacks for me, really, in a tip drill pick. But Ur he makes it easier for Pat Willis to get the highlight. Got a highlight reel of Pat Willis coming out soon, man. It might be my favorite card in the game. He might be my favorite card, man. He really is that great. Got to run abilities on him. Enforcer, tackle supreme, lurker. I'm jumping out the gym. I'm hitting hard. And I'm hitting. I'm making every tackle. John Taylor the goon too, man. You guys already seen the NFL 100 cornerbacks, man. So let's talk about this D-line. You see we added big boy Warren Sack. Another ultimate legend just added. We added three of them. Calvin, Walter Jones, and Warren Sapp. We used our 96 power pass on Calvin, and we paid for Jones and Sapp. They're pretty cheap. Compare the two cars, not even close. I was using John Henderson all this time, and I was still making top 100 in week one. You need to understand how horrible this card is. I got him to shed blocks. He was shedding nothing whatsoever. This run meta is crazy. This man, Peyton Manning outran this man and threw a dot. Threw an absolute dot on the run. It looked like Peyton Man had escape artist, man. Compare Aaron Donald to any of these guys, man. Fast. Warren Sapp, fast. Can get sacks on escape artist quarterbacks like Lamar, Vic, Mahomes. That John Henderson card was horrible, man. Oh, my goodness. You guys already know about Reggie White. He was on the team for a minute. We got a new punter, literally, right before I recorded this video. Uh, he got him for about 100000 exactly. And then I sold the punter I had for 60k. So it was an upgrade, cost about 50,000. I got 95 pump power now. And that's an upgrade from 92. I had Moss here. And it was uh, taking away his Moss 100 on kickoff. So I'm glad I realized that and then uh, I took him off. Yeah, I got Torah Holt returning kicks with a fake Tyreek Hill too. Uh, not too much on specialists. Just, you know, same cars really. And then, uh,. We should upgrade those Niners uniforms. And that's what you probably do, but we got the Jets uniforms this week in Weekend League. I had the Chiefs uniforms last week since they won the Super Bowl. Got some Mahomes clips in the uh, Chiefs uniforms. But now it's time to go on to my favorite ones, man. I got so many coins, I can just keep changing out uniforms every time. They're like 20K a pop. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. All black Jets jerseys coming out this week. Okay, we're going to need two game of the weeks. We didn't have a good game last week. So, we're going to need two. I was 22 on one. And the one game I lost, my Agato turned off on me during the extra point. So, it is, a, it is whack. But, we will definitely... We're going to be tough to beat. So, if somebody beats us this week, it will be a game of the week. I'm in my bag. Hope to see you guys on the next one.